Good afternoon folks and welcome. Let me just have a quick uh, slurp of my Coca-Cola. I've got a frog in my throat. There we go. Right. <coughs> I've decided to move on to the uh, this uh, lovely old uh, Dancet uh, Senior, I believe it is. I've never had one in my possession, it's not mine, it belongs to uh, Phil, who I'm doing these repairs for, it's one of his. Uh, he liked this going because he really likes it. Although saying that, he's recently purchased a hacker gondolier with the extra ramp, the lucky fucker. And uh, he got it, I won't disclose the price, but he got it a really good price. And, uh, like I say, the lucky fucker. Anyway, um, he generally uses this daily, you know, if it were a car, it would be his daily driver. You know, that kind of idea, that's how much use this uh, unit gets. He likes this unit a lot. But saying that... Uh, once he's, uh, there's all the old capacitors out of that stereo sound. Uh, let's just get these in the tub over here, because I'm not quite finished with those yet. Get these in this tub here. And then I can use this tub to put the screws out of this into. Oh, we're not we're not finished with the Alba radiogram yet. I put that on hold because uh, it's got a bit of a sticky problem. I'm not sure as to what it's causing it, but yeah, this is a new screws put in it. These screws are definitely not original, but they're in keeping. But they're they're in keeping with the rest of the player. They're what would have been here. And apparently the complaint with this one is no sound. So most of most of you are probably thinking, yeah, probably the valve. Yeah, it could be. It could be the valve. But there again, the reservoir cap could have gone open uh, inside the can. Uh, that would do. That would cause that. So, there's a few things that can cause it, but this is in for a major overall anyway, so uh, needless to say, anything that needs to be done will be done. I mean, I've had that where there's been no sound on a record player, not particularly one of these, because I've never had one of these, but I have actually had one where there's been no sound completely, and let's see what we've got in here. Oh, this is a similar, it is, it's a similar one to, it's very similar to my dance set. It's very similar, it's a very similar, very similar layout to my dance set. Uh, yeah, it is, it's a very similar layout. Um, practically the same amp as it happens. The only difference is mine's got a bass and treble control on it. But uh, this is, yeah, this is very, very, very similar to mine. So let's plug in and see what we get. Let's plug it in and see what we get. Let's put the lid down. I want to see if the recce are out lights so. up. If the recce doesn't light up then, you know. Hey up. Looks like somebody's let the cocksucker out. There we go.
do the rectifier lights up because I think well, we'll get the main transformer home power the lights on I want to just see if any heat gets in turn valve because you can't fucking see. Well the Well the rectifier's not lit. The other two valves are. Right. Rectifier is not lit. What rectifier is it? The other two are lit. What rectifier is it? So just as no HT. Six 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 five six six five rectifier rectifier's foot. I don't think I've got one. Six six five. Might have to be ordered because uh, this is nice. Um, I could put diodes across it, might end up having to do that, but. So you can get a rectifier for it first, that's the problem. Rectifier, it's not lighting. The other two valves are, so and that's stone cold, it's not lighting at all. Right. Hey folks, and um, uh, this is uh, still part one of the uh, the the uh, dance set uh, uh, Senator I believe it is um, and what I'm gonna do I'm gonna leave I'm gonna put this on hold for a few days because I've just spoken to Phil and he uh, wants to order the valve and he's gonna have the valve sent here it does need a new rectifier so he's, I've, got, I've sent him the details he's going to uh, purchase the valve and uh, send it to me I have it that sent directly here for fitting uh, so I'm going to leave this for now. So what we'll do, we'll put the uh, uh, this was supposed to be red. This record player. <laughs> Obviously, somebody put the wrong board on it when it was done. Wrote the wrong colour on it. Anyway, what we're going to do, we're going to just uh, put it back together. I'll just put these screws in here. Because uh, they'll, they'll have to come back out again. I'll just rest them in there. They will fall into the bottom. I know that. But at least they won't get lost. 
and we'll uh, put this on hold for now folks until uh, make sure the arms clip down it is unplug the there we go the lead put the at least I won't have to do a power lead upgrade on this it's lovely and original complete with Baker light plug so always store let me just tell you something when you put a power lead back into a record player case always store the power lead at the back of it there at this side that way when you're carrying it especially on the ones where you know where where the where where the deck where the arm is tilted upwards or downwards always carry it and put the lead where it won't smash into the arm you know and what I'll do I'm going to put this back where it came from for now because there's nothing more I can do until the valve turns up um, I am going to do a recap on this but there's no sense doing that until it gets until the valve gets here so what I'm going to do I'm going to put this back away and what I think we'll do tonight I think we'll look at my uh, I think what we'll do, we'll, we'll do my tape recorder tonight, the tape recorder I purchased on Saturday. The sound, uh, I think it's a sound triple four uh, tape recorder. We'll do that and we'll go through that together and uh, <coughs> that'll be, because I can do that in the night. Because me, me, me and Steve had a look at it yesterday and it's not really too bad. So we're going to... Uh, We'll have a look at that tonight, I think. And we'll get that on the bench in a few minutes and get that done. Anyway, folks, uh, this will be back on in a couple of days. I'm just trying to find the friggin' remote. There it is. Uh, this will be back on in a day or so, uh, as soon as the valve gets to me. Uh, the valve will be ordered tonight, and it should uh, it'll come straight from the seller straight to me. Um... I was going to put diodes in it, but, uh, you know, I just think it, I just think if you can, then, you know, if you can, then keep it original. We've managed to find a new old stock valve at a reasonable price, so, yeah, sorted. So this can be put back on the back burner, and uh, I will have a look at my uh, tape recorder, and that tape recorder weighs a tonne. Uh, but it needs the motors doing, the idlers doing. There's no belts in there apart from the tape counter belt. Uh, so that's the job for tonight, folks. So uh, I'll be back in a tick. <laughs>